Hey, hey, what is up, everybody? Mark here. Today, I'm going to give you a quick overview of how this hockey puck display can go together. Now, right before I show you all the parts, I want to emphasize two things. Number one, I intentionally made this so that you can use any thickness of material that you want or any kind of material that you want because none of the pieces have to fit together. So you're not going to have to adjust any slots or tabs or anything like that. So I think a lot of you are going to like that. And uh, the second thing is that depending on what thickness of material you choose to use, you may need to use more of some of these spacers than I'm going to have in this example. So let me just jump into it and you'll know what I mean. So here's all the pieces that you're going to cut out, including, uh, let's just go over the pieces. There's quite a few of these little things I call spacers that you're going to cut. And uh, there's these small, uh, slightly rounded ones here. And then there's also three of these rectangles right here. So let me show you how this goes together. This is the back piece here, and it's, you know it's the back because it has the holes in it that are going to eventually probably be screwed to a wall if you're going to mount it to a wall uh, or, or just hang it on some nails if, or screws if you want. Or you can also just display it on a table. But this is the back piece, the front piece, and um, it's going to end up being just like this when we're all done. And then I've got these two pieces I'm going to refer to as support pieces. So the way that this works is the support piece has score marks right here, uh, five sets of score marks that you are going to take these spacers and you're going to glue them right in there between the score marks. And what you're going to do, uh, I, I am using Glowforge thick draft board right now. So it's approximately a quarter inch thick. It's actually a little less than that. Uh, but I'm going to take three of these spacers, one, two, three, and I'm going to glue them together in a stack just like this and get them all nice and straight. Glue those together. I'm going to glue five different stacks of three together. And once that glue is done and dry and solid, I can go ahead and glue it onto this right here. Or technically, you could probably do that together as long as you keep it straight. So you want to take a stack of three in this case, glue it right there, and do the same on all five of these spaces. And again, if you're using a different uh, thickness of material, you may have to do four of these because your goal is, of course, to make it wide enough to uh, be one inch wide so that it can hold up this uh, hockey puck, the standard sized uh, one inch wide hockey puck. So you're going to take a stack of these, glue them together. You're going to glue them right there uh, between those score lines do five stacks of them, and then you're going to take this and you're going to align it right there along that score line. You see that one right there? That's to help you know where this goes. So then you're going to glue it there with your five stacks on there. You're going to take this other one, do the same thing, glue this uh, support piece right here, um, right along the score line. And when that's dried, then you, when both of these are dried, then you are ready to then glue this together with that. And of course, once they're dry, it'll be a lot easier to be able to line those up. You actually could, once they're dry, just do this one and then do the, the top one like that. Oh, I forgot to mention these. Forgive me. These uh, rectangles here do the same thing. You're going to go ahead and glue them together in a stack like that. And then you're going to glue it right there so that you've got a nice set of uh, spacers that will hold this all together. Get a nice and good amount of glue there. And then that's going to go just like this on top of everything. I've also got a JPEG included in the file that also color codes all these and shows you again in a visual way how these all go together. But I think you're going to find this easy to put together. Just be patient with the glue. And once you're done, you'll be able to uh, display up to five hockey pucks um, at your convenience. I think it would look great if you would paint this uh, a nice bright color or red or, or whatever color you want to because it'll really contrast well with the hockey pucks. And if you really want to be creative, it'd be great if you'd wrap the uh, blade with some tape, just like a real hockey uh, stick would have. You could even wrap some up here around the handle. That would give it a lot of personality. Uh, feel free to engrave uh, some logos here or a team logo, a stick logo, uh, congratulations to a team, whatever you want to do, but just really have a good time customizing this. I would love to see what you guys do, but I think you'll find it easy to put together and it will look great. So thanks for watching. Let me know what you guys create and I'll see you in the next one.